Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dak Deck, and today we're playing some more Planet Crafter. So, last episode, we went all the way around that way. Absolutely miles away. And we found some new resources, like the Zeolite. Um, if I come in here... Which one was my map one? This one. Yeah, we went all the way around there. It was this dark area up this way, wasn't it? I don't think it was. I think it was further this way. And now I think we're out of map range. It was somewhere. We went to a nice shiny zone that I'd not seen before. Oh, it was there. We went there. Oh, so I didn't get to where the lava stuff was. Is that another giant ship that's there? Anyway, I'm uh, I'm not doing too well on food at the minute. Let's get down here and let's get some food. Um, I'm just going to have one of them. So, what are we going to do today? I think we're starting to get to the point where I'm just going to need loads more power. And I'm kind of almost boxing myself in. Kind of. I wonder... Now, I don't have to build power actually on the grid of the base, but I kind of want to. Just because I want to make it feel like the base is all one giant connected structure. Hmm. Where could we do something like that? I love this jetpack, by the way. It's amazing. If I move these drills, I bet we could expand the base. See, I don't like that this has got a ramp here. I wish these things wouldn't have the angled corners and the slants like this one, and then I can just build it in as I see fit, but mm, that, that's not how it works, unfortunately. Failing that, we could just leave power where it is at the minute. And I could get another row of solar panels there. How are we actually doing for power? Like, are we in a good spot or not? Uh, where is my power? We've got 54 kilowatts available. How much do we get for crafting one of the tier 2 solar panels? Because I can't really do any more of these nuclear reactors at the minute. They only give 19. They give like 300. It's so upsetting that I can't get more uranium at the minute. <clears throat> That's all we've got. And until I get to better miners, we can't get anything past basic resources. Uh, we've got plenty of iron. Screw it. Give me all of this. Now, how long is it going to take before this starts clipping into the floor? So I don't think it's going to be all that long. Oh, I don't know. Is it going to be this direction that's going to hit the ground first? I think I'm going to move my power back this way. Can I get it to the same width as the base currently? Please don't clip into the floor. It's done it by like a pixel there. Mm. I mean, I don't actually need that one there. I'm going to go with this. I know it sinks into the floor just a little bit. Are we completely out of iron? Jesus Christ, we just chomped through that, didn't we? And that's all we've got left. Have we got any... We've got some more iron in here. Let's at least try and get the perimeter of this dam. It does mean I'm going to have to move my drills, but that's fine. And yeah, I know there's kind of no point for that one that's sunk into the ground there, but it's staying there. Right. Have I checked you guys any time recently? Not particularly. I mean, I'm going to need all of these resources anyway for more solar panels. Are you going to be prissy about me doing that while that's there? Yes, you are. Thought I'd miss that one then with a snap. 
Then I think drills could just go at the back here. Can I do these two at a time? I can do these two at a time. So. Probably let's start from this end. I at least want the first one. Like so. I don't get why these all rotate back round. Yeah, we're going to put all these out here. I'm going to have to move this. Maybe I could have that off the edge here, actually. Let's have a look. It's uh, it's raining a little bit. Uh, what am I doing? Tier 2 drills. Right there. Spin it round again. Have we got thunder? Right there. Yeah, it's rather windy. Eventually I'm going to be able to get more of these drills now that they're at the end of the base like this. The scanner thing is just right where I don't want it to be. The other resources weren't getting in the way. Is it easier if I do it from this side? It is actually easier if I do it from this side. Crap, I should have been holding control. Oxygen low, we're fine. If he's slowly getting more and more onto the thing, it's fine. It's fine. Oxygen critical. It's all right. I'm fixing it. Wow, we were out there for actually quite a while, weren't we? Oop. And oop. In fact, these two drills might fit in line with the base currently. And then that means we could technically double the amount of uh, drills we've got. Again, I so wish these would snap to a grid. Yeah. I mean, they don't line up with the base, exactly, but this first one does. It's in the middle of that. Yeah, that'll do nicely. Drills have been moved. Um, right, I need more iron. So today we are literally going to focus on upgrading the amount of power we've got coming in, because then hopefully that's going to make it so that I've not got to worry about it for a bit longer. Am I going to move my... Reactors, possibly. Let's go drop off all the other resources that I've got. Titanium, we're full on. Throw that in there. Cobalt also seems like we're full on it. Throw that in there. Silicon, that's good. We needed it. Magnesium, we're full on. I think I've got magnesium in this one at the minute. It's just to empty all of these out. Nothing, nothing. If we've got all these, we don't want them getting completely filled up. Otherwise, what's the point? Yeah, that's going to get moved in a second. I hope this doesn't, like, crown in the middle of this. That would upset me greatly. Get rid of that. Get rid of that a second. <clears throat> and... So really, I want it like that. And then it's more out the way. The rocket silo is brilliant where it is. Um, it's just that that's not brilliant where it is. More titanium or cobalt, silicon. We're filling up on the basic resources quite nicely. 
that building right there as well is annoying me. I think I'm going to slowly transition the base. I, when I've moved power, I might start doing the bigger foundation uh, foundations, living quarters as well. But aren't I going to need a load of super alloy for that? Probably. I don't know why I'm pressing this when I can just press this. Unfortunately, though, that is it for um, all the free iron that we've got. But if I get more power, I can get more of the auto drills and we can get more of the basic resources coming in. It's only a few more to move there. And then how are we going to do this? In fact, I might leave my reactors there. Have two that side. Mm, no, because I'm trying to move things away from the base. I know, I know it's going to shut it down. Don't worry. Is there any particular way that this is like the right way around? I so nearly got it to line up. I want that pipe in the middle of that beam there, and this pipe on the right in the middle of that beam there. It's pretty good, right? That'll do nicely. I don't want one square in front of the door, is the problem. Has anybody got just a touch more iron for me? You're not going to make me go out and gather my own iron, are you? That's just freaking rude. Water! I was ignoring the messages for too long there. I nearly died. Let me go out and grab my own iron for a minute then. God, I thought farming resources was getting beneath me, but... Apparently not. Titanium everywhere. I keep getting fooled by it as well. Come on. Oh, we've got little ponds appearing over here as well. Oh, that's the point. Did I get all the chests that were in these little ponds before they filled up? Seriously. Iron? It took me that long to find one. At least the entire planet's not just orange anymore. My oxygen? I need to start paying attention to things in that bottom left corner again, don't I? I'm, I'm coming. Don't kill me. I think I only need one more foundation piece there to make that work properly. Um, throw that in there, that in there. And my overflow chest is full. It won't be soon. It won't be soon. Because we're going to start building more solar panels. Right, if I get rid of... Do I need to get rid of one? Just slap that one there. Admittedly, this is blocking my windows, but... Right, I'm not rotating these at all, because then I'm going to know that they're all the right direction. And then I could get another one right there. Another one will go this side, and then solar panels are going to be... All this room up here. Right, how many of these can I take down in one game? Three, four, five. <clears throat> I can do five at a time. And please tell me I'm not going to have to rotate these where they are. Yeah, I am. Shall I have these on the grids like this as well? I prefer them in the middle. Hopefully we can get five the other side as well. I wasn't rotating any of them. <clears throat> Please, just keep the orientation that I give you. Is it? It's one roll upwards. 
one control roll upwards. And let's can one, two, three, four, five, you beauty. It works out amazingly. Get red, get red, get red. Four, five. Admittedly, I can't do it this side at the minute, but we'll get there. One, two. I don't know why I'm counting. There's no reason to count. We're just putting them back down. <clears throat> so we're about to get 10, 20, 30. We're about to get 60 solar panels this side if we just keep going with this pattern that we're doing now. <clears throat> I kind of need some lights out here, don't I? And then I'm about to run miners at least a bit further up this way, all the way down that side. Water collector might have to move because I think that's a little bit in the way. Is my light on? It doesn't feel very bright. Um. Oh, it's F. And no, my light wasn't on. I'm going to need another beans. And I remember watching the last bit of my last episode. Are these all done now? 100%, 100%, 100%. We want them all on the same cycle. Beauty. Um, just eat one of them squashes. Throw everything back in there. And give me one back. This chest's looking nice and full. I'm going to need another water on me just in case. Right. I can do five of these at a time. So what do we need? Iron. <laughs> Damn it. <clears throat> I also need to get more of the foundation pieces down, don't I? One, two, three, four, five. Well, let's go three at the minute. And then it's... I can pin this, can't I? Three. I wanted to call that lithium. It's magnesium. We've got the three silicon. We need six cobalt. Uh, we've got three, four, five, six... What's the last item there? Aluminium. Oh boy. I need to go out and get some aluminium. <clears throat> we can just have a quick run over this way, can't we? Although that new area had a load of aluminium, didn't it? Uh, we could always have a trip out at some point today, but I was kind of wanting to just focus on boosting my power. So if we could get more iridium... Uranium, sorry, uranium, not iridium. We'd get more uranium while laughing. Might as well grab that while I'm here. Now, we have been struggling to find aluminium in these areas. Hopefully not today. Although that new area that we went to had absolutely loads of it, didn't it? Iron. Got two more slots. It's alright, I'm keeping an eye on the oxygen, don't worry. Silicon, we don't need silicon. Magnesium. Can I get one more aluminium, please? No? Oh, bogger you then, game. Bogger you. Can I just go up and over this? Hello. Aluminium. Oh, and a blueprint chip. Uh, Put that back in there. I'll take the blueprint chip. Never know what we might get out of that. Maybe we'll get the tier 2 deconstructor. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Then we can go back to these ships that I've been to and clear the rest of them out. And I wonder what you get from um, actually taking them computer things apart. Super alloy, aluminium, maybe. Be nice, wouldn't it? 
So I kind of just need to let the miners do their thing for a little bit now, don't I? Uh, this one. Oh, you ball. Where's it gone? There. Absolute imbecile. Beauty. And I've got a little bit more iron that I can fill more of this in with. Try and get... Reach full lake levels. Ooh, lake water collector. I need one more tile here, and then I can do 15 solar panels this side as well. Obviously when I've got more resources. Um, we've got loads more of that. Cobalt and stuff. It's just the iron. I just need loads of iron. Um, iridium can go in there. Well, I need aluminium as well at this point. Blueprint chip. What have you got for me? Tier 3 agility boots? They done... Two super alloys and an explosive powder. I've got two super alloys. How did we make the explosive powder again? Is that in here? Two sulfur and an iridium. Two sulfur, an iridium, one explosive powder coming up. Hydration's level is low, I know. Two super alloy. Damn it, you can't get up the ladder from the back. I will remember that at some point. And agility boots level three. It's another 15% run speed. We really get around now, don't we? How's power looking there? Only 112 kilowatts extra available, but still, that's not bad. Next stage is moss, and that is real slow. But we needed more power to be able to get more... I don't really need more algae machines at the minute, do I? This seems to be coming in quite nicely. I need more drills and stuff. Oh, look. I'll happily take all this. Why is it sunk, though? I thought it was meant to be joined to the underside of the... Um, well, they're not lily pads. Whatever they are. And that lake water collector. Do we do we actually need that? I feel like I've got enough water coming in at the minute from where we are. Where is it? Lake water collector collects and filters water from water surface. Only uses 19 energy. See, this uses 11 and it's doing fine for us at the minute. So I feel like I need more of these. I'm going to need more obsidian, uh, iridium rods, aren't I? More aluminium as well. To get a water down as just because. The super alloy is fine at the minute. And how much power do they take each? 34 energy. I can get at least three osmium. How are we doing for osmium? One, two, three. Six, seven, eight. I'm going to need absolutely loads of iridium. Let's see if we can get a few extra miners down this episode. Just to increase the amount of... Oh, I've got more solar panels this side to move as well. Okay. You've, you've seen me move enough of them at the minute. Zoop. I don't know about having these beacons around the place. <clears throat> I mean, it's good because I did kind of get lost a bit last episode and nearly died, didn't I? Is there even going to be any more iridium around here? I'm still not sure that the um, resources respawn. Is some of the iridium that I got from like these central pillars, we got absolutely ages again. And it doesn't seem like it's come back yet. Hmm. Hmm. 
And without more uranium, I can't call more of the rockets in. Unless we find somewhere that's got just ridiculous uranium generation. Let's have another trip up here, shall we? I was going to say I did have a base out this way, right? Am I flying past aluminium in this place? I don't think so. Sulfur. We kind of need more sulfur, don't we? Iron. Aluminium. This has turned into a bit of a mining trip. And we're getting things that I... I do need them. But I need other things more. Aluminium, we definitely need loads of that. Was there any iridium through here? No, but we've got nice chunks of iron. Which I don't particularly need massive amounts of at the minute, do I? Well, yeah, I do. You need iron for pretty much everything. was hoping there'd be some iridium through here. You know where it's going to be, don't you? We're going to have to go all the way out back to that um, other biome, the dark biome. It's going to be in the larvary area. Come on, might as well grab all the iron that we can see. Maybe that's where we're going to have to go next episode. And I may start taking more stuff out to make the beacons. It's just titanium and silicon. It's not difficult to make. Let's call this one... I don't know. I mean, this looks like poison. If I just start calling them all at post, do we think that'll be good enough? I think just calling them at post will be good enough. And we'll have them as a different colour. This one could be this blue, because that's quite a nice looking blue. Yeah. Right, can I get some more aluminium while I'm out here? We've got some sulfur as well. Should really get another titanium and another silicon, but we've not got any more outposts between here and there, have we? There's another silicon. Aluminium. More sulfur. Wow, it really gets thicker in some places, doesn't it? I wonder if there's different directions that I've not been to yet. Have we been through here? Oh, wait, yeah, this looks like it's going round the back of that large ship. I'm pretty sure it is. And I don't think I've got a beacon in there anyway. <clears throat> Get some more iron. Yeah, we're going to have to take stuff all the way up there. <clears throat> um, what were we running out of last time when I ventured that way? It was water, wasn't it? I'm going to take a couple of water, a couple of oxygen with me this time. And let's get another one of these, Dan. Why are you like this? Yep, that nice blue. Another outpost. Just while we're here, let's have a quick trip to the top of this hill. We've not actually been this direction yet. <clears throat> I think this is the frozen biome. It's not frozen anymore. It's got some quite nice waterfalls, actually. That looks rather pretty. Some nice flowing lakes. New message received.
Just a very, very quick excursion up here. I was hoping that we might find some iridium. I mean, or aluminium. Aluminium would be good as well. It's not looking like iridium lives up here, then. I mean, it was quite frozen. When we first uh, headed up this way. More iron it is, then. If there's no more aluminium at the minute. I keep getting more titanium. I've got so much titanium back at base. Inventory's full. Wonderful. Yeah, we need to start labelling all these outposts. I don't want to get lost. But I think that's where we're going to leave it for this episode. We've expanded power at least a little bit until I can get more uh, uranium coming in. And um, next episode, I think we're going to get... What have you got? Eat that for now, just so I've got some space to shift some of this around. That in there, that out there, that in there, that out there, that in there. I mean, I'll come back for it eventually, or I'll just forget about it, one of the two. Um, but yeah, that's where we're leaving it for today's episode. Next episode, we're going to go back out to that dark area and see if we can fandangle our way around to that larvary looking biome and hope there's going to be iridium there. So I can just get more of the auto miners down and get more of the basic resources coming in to get more power. You know, it, it's all a vicious cycle at this point. And obviously the drills are going to help with the pressure and the heat slightly as well, right? Heat 17.5, yeah. Pressure's 15. Yeah, that, that works out beautifully. And it gets me resources as well. Plus there is the tier 2 ones that we can get to eventually. But yeah. That's where we're leaving it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments and feedback greatly appreciated as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.